Hi! Hi folks. Well, recently the Japanese Lawyer Association, they have come out publicly against the death penalty in Japan. They are urging the Japanese government to do away with the death penalty and replace it with life imprisonment. And based upon this announcement by this lawyers group, the European Union, Norway and Iceland they express joy in the fact that Japan may do away with the death penalty. Now, the Lawyer Association is saying we'd like to see Japan to do away with the death penalty because it's wrong, so says they, by the year 2020. So it's okay to execute someone in the year 2019, right? No problem with that. But 2020, cut it out. Tell that to the people who are going to be executed in 2019. Where do you get off setting a date like this? If you're against the death penalty, end it now. Not in the future date, because all those between now and then who are executed could have had their lives saved had you been more assertive. But never mind that. The aspect of this video is not so much with that nonsense as it is with the Europeans involving themselves in this issue. The European Union, Norway, Iceland, Officials in the United Kingdom, France, and Italy claim that they regularly urge the Japanese government to do, do away with the death penalty. So all of Europe is concerned with the Japanese death penalty. Those bloodthirsty samurais in Japan! They execute three or four people a year. Now I understand some of you are going to say one is too much, but let's put it in perspective. They execute three or four people a year, and the Europeans are concerned about those executions. What about in China? Where's the concern there, where they systematically kill thousands Tibetans and Uyghurs in East Turkestan for their organs or for political reasons? Where's the loud cry from the Europeans? Gee, I don't hear any. Many nations in the Middle East have what's called honor killings. If the female in the household does something to dishonor the family, just kill her and the law protects you. Yeah! And some of those very same countries, they're throwing homosexuals off the buildings. Murder them! The Iranians execute them. No problem! Because the bigger problem is the three or four executions in Japan. Do you see how lopsided that is? Why are these imperialists from Europe concerned with Japan while ignoring China and with second place in the Middle East? So now some of you probably are going to say, now wait a minute, they also is a concerns about the Middle East and China. Really? Is that what you're going to say? Then my reply to that is, out of the Middle East and out of China where the majority of executions are taking place, that's where they should zero their efforts. Japan should be in the bottom of the list. But no, the imperialists have to bother the people in Japan. To the good people in Japan, I say this to you. Whether you have the execution or not, the death penalty or not, that should be your decision. Do not allow any outside influence to creep into your country to telling you to do away with it or to keep it. It's nobody's business but the Japanese. And if there's any groups within the nation of Japan that are being unduly influenced by these outside groups, then that should discredit them in this debate. Very simple. The death penalty in Japan is for the Japanese. All the others, mind your own business. All right, folks. We'll see you. God bless you. God bless America. God bless the nation you happen to be in. God bless our good <laughs> friends and trusted allies and the land of the rising sun, Nihon Japan. Matane! <laughs>